Hey, what's up, people? It's your boy Blue here for the aftercast. Y'all best be clicking that like button. Oh, yeah. it's your boy Old Ninja. So, it's your, old, it's your boy Old Ninja. <laughs> I'm, I'm a little bit tipsy because I had a few fucking great goddamn beers. beers. I had half a beer. Dude, that cider shit. So, we like tested that? some cider. It was actually good. Yeah. The thing was that had a, it had a smooth taste at first and it had a bitter aftertaste. I'm not about bitter beer. However, yeah. if I was a drinker, I would be drinking cider and I'd probably get fucked up on it. It was pretty good. It was pretty it good. Was it good. was a bourbon fuse cider, which was different. I never had that before. It was actually really good. I had it uh, at a cider fest I went to this weekend, which was fucking delicious. It was uh, great. Yeah, had so you had beer. sweet beer all weekend. Uh, there were some sours and some gross ass ones. Like uh, there was one. So for the cider fest, I talked about this on the before the cast. So if you watch that, you know what I'm about to say. But um, there was the way the cider fest worked. It wasn't unlimited pours like how I'm used to with the beer fest. You actually had like a number of tickets that you can use. And every place you went to, they would ask for a ticket. It's almost like fucking being at uh, Santa Cruz Beach Boardwalk and shit like that. Oh, like any like yeah. Event like that. But there was one. There was a. There was one company who was just giving away their fucking beer for free. Like they had like a line that showed up, and all of a sudden they just opened a fucking tap on the on their fucking cider thingy, and uh, it was a free for all. And the beer they, the cider they had was fucking gross. It was disgusting. <laughs> That's was why the, they're giving away for free. It was free. the worst fucking cider I ever had. Oh, it tastes like fuck. fucking. It tastes like. <laughs> it tastes <laughs> like fucking wood. Tastes like homeless and toes. Cheese. It was fucking gross. Tastes like homeless toes. Yeah. <laughs> so we're at Burger King right now. We're about to order some food. This is gonna be hilarious. We are hungry. We're hungry. Let's see if they notice my black lisp. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let's see if they make it. Hi, welcome to Burger King. Can I help you? Yeah. Can nah, I get the sponsored. Angry Whopper with uh, no tomato, please? Hey, this is sandwich. Yeah. Anything else? Yeah. And then I'm gonna get an English Whopper at this. Uh, can I get another Angry Whopper, uh, regular? I want the meal? That's perfect. Okay. Uh, uh, that's it. Hey, this is Sandwich. Can I get a Sandwich with Angry Whopper? Yeah. Anything else? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Anything else? Yeah. 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 Okay. Anything else? Oh, we had the, uh, the black, black burger, whopper, the Halloween yeah. whopper. Oh this God. is months ago. You got to go back. You got to rewind the tape. I got you on this one, man. I got a dollar. Oh, you got a dollar? <laughs> <laughs> Just like that, folks. Using your card? Yeah. Plastic. So I don't carry cash on me. Fucking, I don't get robbed. Oh, I always have cash. I try to be like Do you get robbed? <laughs> nope, I try to be like Cronish. Oh, see. Why there ain't nobody behind Yeah, she made it full forward because they're probably afraid that we're going to try to rob her. Oh, there's someone else here. Oh, oh we ain't alone. Free. We ain't alone this time. So check this out. Usually we go to this Burger King. They fucking make us pull out to the side past the window. And we're always like, why the fuck are they making us do this shit? And it's always, usually, almost always us. This is the first time we've seen another car in front of us. So they told them to pull out to the side. Now they come out through the back fucking door, not where, not a fucking side door. <laughs> like there's a back door where like the fucking trash and shit is. There's and no, they we're bring not, our fucking food. There's to no it. fucking park. We're not parking in a parking lot. We're like in a fucking alley right now. Yeah. For so I don't get. Un I don't understand why they fucking do this shit. One day we should probably fucking ask them why the fuck they make us do this shit. I, like. I, Set. Maybe because there's a church next to them or some shit. Maybe that's part of the fucking angry whopper. You, they want you to get angry before you fucking eat the whopper. I don't. Maybe I don't know. Does that makes sense. Cause maybe I'm about to slap somebody, and give them a burger. Fuck your feelings. Food. I'm hungry, mm. goddamn it. They should call it the the hungry burger. Like, mm. Wait, no, what's the hang hungry hangry? Hangry burger. <laughs> hangry. They call it the hangry burger. Hangry. You're fucking hungry and you're angry. angry. Can be like fuck yo feelings. Man, I've been fucking hangry before. I fucking hit a little kid once. Whoa. But that was back when I was like 17. Whoa, so it that's matter. still bad, fool. The kid was like mm, 13, 12, 12 ish. So yeah, they can take a you quick You doing little... some fucking, some, uh, what's his name? Fucking Cat Williams shit? No, no. So <laughs> this kid, he fucking jumped up through the sunroof and slapped me on the head. Because he knew, he knew I already knew I was angry. He just wanted to piss me off more. And I fucking opened the door really quick and caught him as he was fucking like coming down. He like fell on the ground. And... <laughs> 
Why even with the door? Yeah, with the door. That's terrible. That kid probably had broken some shit. Nah, it's still, it's cool. That little kid's cool. What do you mean he's cool? You in with the door? No, he was a cute, he was a cool little kid. Yeah. Fucking a bugaboo. Okay. That shit, Marcus, you asked for no tomatoes. I did ask for no tomato. shit. Right here, no tomato marks. Alright. You want your shit now or you want to wait? Well, I'm gonna, Let's gonna go. hard fucking eat in the podcast. I do it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we got our food. Uh, now we on the road. We, on the road. we are Oscar Mike. Stone Mountain Unit 64. Cross your fingers that nothing fucking happened to us on the ride home because they're crazy shit that fucking usually happens. Nah, because we usually document that shit. People are like, what the fuck? And we like, oh, We still haven't shit. seen that Asian lady in like forever. And today, it's so. It's cold. If you watch, on the before the cast, I'll talk about this. So, this Wednesday or tonight is uh, like garbage day where you can leave out all kind of crazy shit on, the, on your sidewalk and the, the garbage people pick it up. And um, that's usually when we saw, well, we saw this lady like usually at night when we were finished with the podcast and she'd be collecting cans. But we haven't seen her in like the longest fucking time since like last fall. So it's yeah. been a good few months. Yeah, since it's not getting cold. Yeah. It's been a while. She hasn't been fucking. Uh, so we. Maybe she won the lottery. She still. Nah. Uh, well. Never but know. she's been stealing other people. She takes other people's recycling, recycles it herself so she gets the money. Because cans are worth a lot. Yeah, so is true. copper. Copper is like, worth the most. What's like five cents a can or something like something that? Something like that. I don't know. It goes by pound, but it's worth a lot per pound. But that shit's worth a lot, a lot, a decent amount too. But it's all that shit's fucking lot. bullshit because you pay. That you do, <laughs> yeah, which is bullshit. You pay ahead of time, but then if you don't recycle, you still pay for it. If yeah. you recycle yourself, you pay for it, but then you get it back. Yeah, all you do is get your money back. So I recycle. Fuck that. I got forty bucks back. Recycling like a couple pounds, ten pounds. When I was a kid, my me and my little brother did that for the summertime. We'd go and fucking collect cans, like cans on the side of the freeway. That's where you get fucking money because it's just fucking. It's gold. Highways of gold is fucking cans. It's all like gold. That. I think one in one trip we made like at least like two hundred dollars. Damn. And we had like a good. We had like maybe four, 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 bags four or five or six bags, garbage bags full of fucking cans. We fucking came up. Damn. We came up like nobody's fucking business, boy. All right. So let's talk about some show. We didn't talk about Legends of Tomorrow on the cast. Yes. See, this is the shit that you miss. Yes. So you gotta tune in to after the cast. We talk about shit that we didn't talk about the show. All right, shut us up. Oh, shit, what the fucking happened? That was like a week ago. <laughs> it was a week ago. So, but most of the um, shows we watched were a fucking week ago. Yeah. So on Arrow, they went into the no. Uh-huh. So in a previous episode, they went to the future and they tried to kill off a kid who was like gonna be like fucking a giant fucking dictator or whatever in the future. But they end up going or. Fuck, what happened? You're trying to think about what happened? So they, so the time police, whatever they call it, the yeah. time, whatever, they sent a, a professional, a professional fucking hitman to go back in time and kill off the people who are the legends of tomorrow. So like they, when they're young or when kids. They're, when they're young kids, when they're fucking vulnerable. And it's really interesting because it's only certain, there's only like a certain point of time where they're vulnerable, where like it won't affect the future. It won't have a huge impact. And so Rick Hunter, who's like the time... Um, time Lord. Time Lord. He, they can't go back and kill him just because if they kill him, anything he's done in the future won't fucking happen, which would be like a huge fucking... Con- paradox. A paradox, yeah. Some shit. So they had to attack all of his team members when they were kids. Yeah. And this, they sent... What do they call her? The... The... Fuck. The, the Viner or something? Yeah, something like some that. Some shit. But she was a no holds barred fucking she shit. She gave no She fuck. had no fucks. She was down to go back and kill babies. Yeah, take them from right after they're born. Yeah, like, Catch so they up. showed, they showed, uh, Firestorm, mm-hmm. the, the young guy, when he's in the incubator, she had a gun. She showed up to blast that little baby away and fucking, they left a note. They yeah. took the baby early and left a note. And then they took a teenage version of White Canary. Where she's like, and then they left her with the teen version of Heat Wave. Yeah, he's, he's all like, like trying to yeah, he's trying to slide in the DMs. Yeah, he's like, well, that booty do, girl. Yeah, pretty much. And then, the, and then they gave them a baby. They're like, nope, you gotta watch this baby. I'm like, oh it shit. It was the the baby version of uh, the, the, Killer, not Killer Frost. No, it was baby version of Firestorm. They gave him Firestorm. No, no, I, I thought I thought they took um no, they baby took, version of uh, what's the name? No, they took Firestorm because he met his dad. 
he met his dad and talked to his dad because he'd never met his dad because his dad took off to go to Mogadishu and he died. So uh, Dr. Stein, who was the other half, he went up to him and told him, hey, go talk to your dad oh, that's true. before yeah. he ships out. What? But then later on, homegirl kidnaps the dad and tries to bargain with them. Give well, up. Well, it's kind of cool. Um, the fire guy, he like talked to his younger self and was like, hey, you know, we know, I, you and I both know, but you, you set that fire and stuff like that. You oh, he burned his house down. Yeah, he burned his house down when he was a kid and he like killed his like sister and shit. Uh, his did family. He kill, yeah, he almost killed them, I think. Yeah. He, he almost killed them and himself and he's, he ran out of the house before telling anyone. Everyone else ran out when the house was burning. Yeah. yeah. So but I thought, bad. what, damn, who, I thought there was another person who was a baby. Wasn't it Captain Code or whatever? Wasn't he a baby too? They tried to kill him as a baby? Yeah, they tried to kill him as a baby okay, too. Okay, okay, that's right. So that baby, yeah, because um, when Captain Cold was a baby, they went and uh, they made the teenage version of Heat Wave watch him. And he's like, if you if you drop my future partner yeah, or okay. lose him, he's like, you're dead. Yeah, you're dead. It's hella funny. So but, then they went to this weird paradoxical place where this lady had a nursery and shit. Yeah. And then we see, it was actually a really cool effect where they went and uh, they tried to distract, uh, I don't even know what their fucking name was, but the, yeah. the assassin. Time, yeah, the assassin. The they time tried, assassin. Yeah, the time assassin. So they tried to stop her, so they all attacked her all at once. Which is But she was great. able to stop time. Yeah. Like in a small bubble. So all of her attacks, she had to keep it up. But the one person she didn't know was the little version of Rip Hunter. Baby Rip Hunter. And he was fucking raw. He hella yeah. stabbed the shit at her. Oh. So then she lost control of time and then got fucked up. She got fucked up. But what was, what was cool about that whole entire fucking scene was that the camera panned around her and they, and it pretty much went into everybody's fucking ability. Like Firestorm went to the fire with uh, White Canary. Uh, I mean, she didn't do anything cool, but she was like oh, in the she cool had ass fucking pole. She, she had her staff. Then they went to Rick Hunter, who had fucking shot out one of a his fucking laser, laser guns. So they had like a cool little beam, like in uh, fucking Star Wars. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh fuck, shit, looks like the exit. Don't tell me this exit's not available. I'll be fucking uh, mad. Yeah, we're not the fucking thing for it. Maybe. Some oh, shit, dude. Oh, man. Look. See? God damn! So it's gonna be a little extended after the cast. Oh fuck it! But not by much though. A few minutes. Oh, it is completely closed. Damn. Oh, they got pictures and shit. Are they fixing a pothole? Damn. We can't even run past them. Oh, oh, there's a fucking hole. There's a hole in the freeway. God damn. Damn, son. Wait, is that an alien behind us? There's like a bright ass fucking light there for a second. Fucking whatever this is. Uh, yeah, so, yeah, just that one scene, like, they looped through it, and, um, uh, who else? Uh, uh, the Atom had a, he was shooting at oh, a beam, he too. The air, yeah. Really cool, so it was, like, a really cool fucking stop-motion image of all the fucking characters attacking this one person, and it was fucking cool as shit. Yeah, it was a pretty cool thing. It was a good, interesting episode, too. It was a great fucking episode. Very interesting. So, ooh. I know a lot of people have been waiting for this. I've been waiting for this. So tomorrow's episode of Legends of Tomorrow, we Ooh. see Hawk Girl get her fucking mace. Yes. Finally. Yes. That's one of her most famous like signature weapons is her mace. And I guess it's uh, it's either made or it is something from her past. We'll find out when it airs. But Hawk Girl gets her fucking mace. Yes. We get to see her fuck shit up. We see them in the future and there's a giant fucking mech. That throws the time ship, so shit's gonna get fucked up. We're probably you know, gonna see a lot more battles. My favorite thing of the entire show is that fucking time ship. That shit's fucking legit. It like is the, legit. the graphics and the budget they spent on that, it's fucking cool as fuck. It is pretty chill. I'm, and it's been approved for a second season. Oh, that's that's, that's fucking, fucking great, right here. But Supergirl, still in limbo. We don't know if they're yeah. coming back. I think they're still deciding. They're probably looking at numbers. I hope they bring it back. I mean, the last episode was really good, too. We didn't yeah, really touch on that well, either. No, yeah, we did. We talked because Cronus Well, not this week. It. Oh, no, not this Wait, week. Wait, was there a new episode? Yeah, no, it's over. We talked about her going oh, to yeah, space that's and that's not being able to breathe and shit. Yeah. Which was weird because she's Supergirl. But then again, it's it depends on who's fucking writing the story. Because, like, even Superman, like... At one point, he couldn't be a breathing space. Well, I mean, wait, you, it's like you said, if you've never been in space before, because in the whole yeah. series, she never goes to space. Like, what she if she talks man, about throwing people into space? Yeah. What if man, mankind can actually breathe in space? No, you can't breathe in fucking space. How we know? 
because there's no atmosphere in space. How do we? How and do we, we know, get and, out of? And space is nearly zero degrees uh, is this? Kelvin. No. Oh, this is fucking funny. So zero in front of us, Kelvin. in front of us is a Sweetness sister. How She's, do you know? Because I know her car. You know her license plate, or you yeah. know her truck? She drives the truck. Yeah, she drives the truck. She's in front of us right now. Is she a cowgirl? No, she ain't no cowgirl. She's probably just getting home. Anyways. So we talked about Legend of Tomorrow. We talked about the Flash in the podcast. Did you, know, did you watch this week's Flash? Yeah, we talked about it. You did most of the talking, but yeah, yeah I threw in my. This I saw the Flash. Great. Tonight is fucking Arrow. I'm watching that shit. Yeah. We didn't even talk about Arrow and how fucking Black Canary's fucking dead. Oh yeah, she fucking died. Holy yeah, shit! I forgot about that. Dead. We didn't talk about that shit. Which is crazy because we like, went this way, couldn't we? No. Just follow the truck in front. I'm of following the truck. Yeah, she would. That truck will take us where we need to be. What? You should like tailgate her and shit and scare her. No. I should fucking jump out and scare her. That'd right, be awesome. So this light, we're about to turn oh, left damn. and the light's red. I want to fucking fucking jump out there and scare her. That'd be bad. Damn, that should be fucking What if she carries a piece? If she carries a burner, your ass is dead. Like blau, no more blue. No. You she, don't know. She, she carry a burner. I've been in her truck. She so she might not have told you she got a burner. I wonder where she's coming from because she's it's probably coming late. back from getting. Mm, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, all over, man. She's a good girl. So they don't mean she ain't busting no Who nuts. knows? What else she, we got going on? She ain't got no man? Nope. Really? She ain't single. Oh, she probably, she's busting somebody's nuts. Busting. That's, that's for another cast. <laughs> that's like my sister down there. She lives in the same house I do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyways, so do you watch Gotham? No, I have it all oh, fucking queued up God though. Damn. All like nineteen episodes of Gotham. Gotham was good too. Gotham, we got to see uh, Bruce Wayne doing a little bit of Batman shit down there. He's Him like and Gotham. Fucking twelve, goddamn. No, he's like sixteen. He's in high he's school. He's like fucking twelve. He looks twelve. <clears throat> all that. No, he's he's like fucking like Carl in fucking Walking Dead where he's, Carl. he he starts off young cool. and now so he's fucking big and shit. Yeah, so he but yeah, puberty. he's like that. He's he's fucking he, he hit his puberty. He's getting fucking taller. Cool. He's uh, messing around with his fucking hot ass chicks and shit like that. But uh, he's not, is he still messing with cat or no? Mm, no, he's not hanging out. with Oh, I heard he's messing with a, another comic book character. Mm, not, not so, not yet so far. Mm. Maybe in I past episodes. Yeah, episode, I don't know. Maybe. I haven't we're seen we're this. Probably so I don't way know. back there. But I have all episodes on there. See, we don't talk about Once Upon a Time. I have yeah. to go on Earth Girls Are Easy on there because I know K Mac watches it. I don't know if Miska watches it, but. I'm pretty sure all of us will probably guess our. You should like keep cast. following her, baby. She thinks it might fall there. All right, people. So we're rolling up to uh, the blue base. <laughs> Got my black ass off. Um, uh. Thanks for watching. Uh, make sure to check out the videos down below, and make sure to smash that subscribe button somewhere over there. And I'm um, like always, leave comments. We'll definitely try to answer them, and we'll definitely try to get back to you. Um, until then. Peace out. Deuces. Bye.